the uh, this modus se uh, sells the plans for the XL1 armor. Oh nope. Um, one of them did though. I think it's in the production. Um, No, no, this, this, uh, nope, not him. Yeah, I bought some earlier, I just don't remember who I bought it from. Yep, we're back now, Larry. Can you hear Wawa too, Larry? Hello. <laughs> Earlier said Larry, Larry said that uh, if he hadn't uh, just put the kid down, he would totally. Uh, <laughs> if he had a what? If he hadn't just put his kid down, he totally would be on his way over. Gotcha. These are like mods though. Oh, there we go. Oh cool. I made you louder too, so Larry can hear you better. Nice. Oh yep, they're all right here. So, so this one doesn't actually have the plans for the armor itself. It has the plans for all the mods. Yeah, no, you already you already you already unlocked all the plans for the armor. Super dope. That's what we did at the archival thing. So now you can craft it at the uh, um, power armor stations. Right. Well, that's super dope. Yeah, I do not have the jetpack one, but that's almost seven thousand caps. <laughs> yeah. Well, I do not have it, but it is possible. And I wonder if uh, what that does as far as carry weight after. Sure. What? Hey, the thing for increased carry weight is 6,000 caps. For the XL1? Yeah. I mean, that's just a mod. That's cool though, the plans were free. But we just get yeah, right, for some of the best armor in the game. Um. So, I might as well try to build it right now. So Damn that uh, calibrated shocks. That is nice. I guess that'll work for for all of it. Like not just the. Like it's not like you don't have to buy calibrated shocks for the heads, the and the legs and the arms. So that's kind of worth it in my opinion. Like it's a lot of money. Yeah, five thousand. I'm gonna save up. <coughs> Put my base out after I. <coughs> I gotta make more stim packs because I gave Larry a bunch of stim packs again. I mean, I, I, I mean, when I say again, I mean I gave him away again. Larry was just the most recent. But yeah. So, either way, um. Oh, and Larry said the echo is gone now too. Nice. Well, so again, it was kind of cool. <laughs> out of years. <laughs> I'm out of everything. I hope Larry's listening so he can figure out where what kind of where he wants to put his base. Copper, aluminum. I was telling him like gears, you can't make a base for gears, just junk. But there's still no guarantee you're gonna get gears and the junk you get either, but Right. Just like picking fans anyway. Anytime you see a fan or a telephone or something like that. Yeah, like, I had everything except for the aluminum, um, which again reminds me, 
Yeah, I really I like where I put this base. Because uh, I, I, um, where I w did have my base, this was like my the one that was by the river and had the, the junk extractor, and that was it. I was like, fuck that junk extractor. I really don't need it. I already have a base with a lead and a junk extractor. I need aluminum. You both get a couple bases with aluminum, or just play the game and shoot stuff. Yeah, well, good luck finding a place with aluminum because you can't have mine. <laughs> <laughs> Do you have just one place for aluminum. Yeah, there was uh, other places I was looking and I couldn't find them. Um, I know two. They're pretty close. To the left side of the map. For aluminum? Yeah. Is it part of a workshop though? Yeah. Yeah, see that's what I refuse. Like I don't want to invest in a workshop just for the game to crash five minutes after we fucking invest our shit in it. Cause yeah, top left, um, the on the like yeah, northeast part of the map there's the red rocket station um workshop and there's like two or three aluminum uh, extractors there. Uh, <clears throat> now, I found like m me and Larry were playing on a private server that I made with my Fallout first, and there's like not crashing. I wasn't really worried. I didn't think it was gonna crash. But then the problem was, uh, then there was no public event like, uh. None of the none of the events like the Fosh Not Parade, we couldn't do it on the private server. I just can't shake these so, positives and negatives. Um, if you wanna, yeah, I don't know. So, like I said, uh, I oh, do you wanna? I don't know where you're at. I went back to my base just to grab some more of my aluminum. Okay, I'm just thinking about where to go, looking to see if there's any fence. Should we just go to one of the fishers and kill some scorch bees? Um, I mean we can. Uh, let's see. I do have a mission that's in the cranberry bog. Okay, yeah, down for whatever. As long as I get to shoot something. Larry did get killed pretty immediately, but that was kind of my fault. Uh, I had us go, like, to a <laughs> place that... Not necessarily recommended for players right away. <laughs> he had no armor. He had nothing but, like, his 10 mil pistol. It was pretty funny. Yeah, getting him weapons in general is going to be very difficult. He's going to have to find himself a level 1, level 5 minigun, and then we'll just give him all the ammo in the world for it. I don't know why you say it would be difficult for him to get guns. Honestly, don't know what you mean by that, but... Uh, but yeah, we were playing, right, and also, like, where I took us, literally, we got mobbed uh, by uh, a bunch of ghouls, like, diseased ghouls. There's like, I had my machine gun and Gatling stuff, and I was able to take care of them, but I almost died, too, almost. <laughs> I'm just trying to figure out... Okay, that's going to be the fastest way. Oh, dude, I have a base at the at the bottom right. Okay, so my mission is at... Uh, Fort Defiance. Floating in space forever. So, I don't, I don't know where your your base is. Is it active? It's not over, not over by Fort Defiance. It's on the map, it's like the big, like, uh, Capital State building. I'll put my, uh, marker on it. Charleston Capital Building? So, the, what? No, it's like, it's like west of Watoga. Fort... 
defiance, not for ants. What? What the fuck? This glitchy ass game. Yeah, do you see where my marker is? Okay, it's. Are you looking at the cranb cranberry bog area? Where's the cranberry bog area? The bottom right. <laughs> Okay, so my marker, it's right on, like, the border of the, like, where it's red and brown. Nope. You don't see it? Nope, I'm gonna put mine down to see if you see mine. Okay. Yes, I see yours. And my... Right over here. Yeah. Now I just see you moved your marker. My marker, yep, you moved again. You're like dancing around my marker. It's not working on mine, that's why. It, just another glitchy game. Yeah, it was disappearing on mine too. I just exited the map and came back to it. But anyway, where's your camp at? I will turn it on right now. Oh my god. It's right over by, right over by the fissure. Yes, now I just saw it pop up, so... It's my... Uh... I don't know, I feel like, uh... Your camp and... Foundation is, uh, exactly as close. Exa <laughs> That's exactly what I was just about to say. <laughs> uh, yeah, six one way. How about you warp to your camp, and I'll warp to Foundation, and then we'll see literally how much it costs for each of us to, uh, fast travel to Fort Defiance. <laughs> is there a ray gun? Larry's asking if there is a ray gun. Um, kind of depends what you mean by ray. There's different energy weapons. There's like laser guns. Um, and then Wawa and I have plasma guns. Uh, so yeah, there's totally different types of ray guns. It's probably going to be like the alien blaster that we haven't got yet. I know, I still haven't got that. They said it's one of the best guns in the game, and I'm like, alright, alright, alright. I'm stocking up ammo for it. I'm always putting ammo away for it. We probably should do that. Why don't we just go figure out where the fuck it's at? Mm. After this. Or maybe before this. Oh, Larry's like, that's it. Apparently, he's asking about the, the alien blaster. I think Larry wants us to go find it. I want to go find that too. <laughs> Alright, well, are you at your camp? Yeah, I'm going to see how much it's going to be. It is 10 caps to go to Fort Defiance. Wow, mine's, uh, mine's 13, but it kind of spawned me on the other side of Fort Defiance. I mean, uh, foundation, I mean. Don't go well, hey, let's say fuck my mission then and figure out where to go find the... Alien Blaster. Gonna be the crater, right? I I don't know. I have no idea where it's at. I mean, I've. Who did I miss a call from? I didn't know oh, I missed a call from you. Was, um, a US or alien it's a. It's my uh, uh, understanding is. Uh, Sorry, I don't, Larry's like, no, I'm on my C-O-U-C-H couch. I spells couch. I don't know why you spelled it with dots. I don't know what you're trying to say, Larry. Uh, um, hold on. F-O-76. Alien Blaster. Wow, the alien blaster round or alien blaster looks very similar to the squirt gun. Larry says because isn't camp done like that in the game? You asked Wawa, was he at his camp? I replied, oh. 
You can't be like meta in small messages, Larry. It's like translation's gonna get lost. It's confusing. Yeah, I'm even more confused than you are. <laughs> <laughs> Your alien blaster ammo? Oh. Oh, it does weigh a lot. Okay, I know where to go to get the alien blaster. Maybe Ward has more drawing paper, I can. I vaguely know where to go to get the alien blaster. <laughs> uh, Okay, so you know how like on the map there's Oh, there it is. Okay. Oh right. Oh man, I, we've been dicking around super close to it this entire time. Seriously. So either one of our camps that is up by the ash heap. Uh, I'm going to activate mine because apparently my camp that's right by the ash heap is super close to where we can find the alien blaster. Okay. Literally, it just, like, I don't exactly know. Let's see. Toxic pond and wreckage. Um. Oh. Yes, super close. One of what? I got a secret service armor piece for you. Didn't you try and drop it and it wouldn't let you? Oh, that's right. Yeah, Mr. Drunky Pants. Whatever. <laughs> <laughs> no, I meant last night when you tried it and you were drunk. <laughs> so somewhere around uh the the Graninger Graninger farm um how does the loot pool in this work Larry's asking uh so um, if it's like on the ground where anybody can see it, it's first come first serve. But if it's in a loot box or like on a dead body, then I can get everything from it, and then Wawa can also get things from it. But it won't necessarily be the same things. That's pretty much my understanding of it, anyway. So yeah, and one of these toxic pools around this farm is apparently going to be just a safe and in the safe there's gonna yeah there's gonna be the alien blaster yeah so once we wow that is a lot of floaters over there there's two nashers and one flamer oh two and two actually All right, happy we found stuff to shoot. Wow, they're fighting something else too. They're not even fighting us. They're like having their own little battle. Oh yeah, there are certain things with dedicated drops and then there's events. 
um, and the events kind of happen randomly, and then you get chances for the events to get certain things, so... Uh, there's like one thing I need for a mission, and the only way to get it is this one event, and you're not guaranteed to get it. And it's a super hard event! It's really annoying. We're just mowing these motherfuckers down. Well, yeah, we got good gun. <laughs> I don't know why that was so funny to me. Yeah, specifically the mission that, uh, uh, Larry, the mission that I need to get done depends on, like, how well you do in the mission. I think if you do really well, then you you have to do, like, a certain... Most missions are like pass or fail. This one that I need, it's like paradise something, I don't even remember. <clears throat> it, it's really hard and I tried it and we didn't, I still got rewards, but yeah. Uh, it's never, It's. I never see it on like when Wawa and I are on playing together. Where are you going, Wawa? Oh, you're over there. So yeah, it's apparently in a pool, like in water, in somewhere, um, in a in a in a safe. It was like covered, like beneath the water surface. I don't know. I'm gonna get rid of my marker. You do you you still don't have the Aqua Boy perk, do you? Nope. Or Aqua Girl in your case, I suppose. Right. Oh. Eyeliner on my character. Yeah, I know. Man, we're just gonna have to have we're just gonna have to repeat our our whole <laughs> talk yesterday. <laughs> Well, I found a safe, but it wasn't in water, and didn't have... Like, if you completed a quest, will it be completed uh, as well on mine? No, actually it won't. Um, no matter who's team leader, uh, unless you have that same quest selected and you're doing things literally at the same time, no. Uh, Wawa is with me all the time, and I'm completing quests, and he still has to do all the same quests. Well, I'm... Whatever. <laughs> I want to play a game, but not do any of the quests. <laughs> <laughs> Watch, I'm going to get to a certain part and do the quest and unlock a vendor, and you're going to be like, Damn, I really want that. What quest do I got to do? Oh, we should have done all the missions. <laughs> I'll be like, no, just this one's. Okay. I still don't really know what these aerosolizers do. Aerosolizers. Yeah, these giant... Yeah. I don't understand the purpose of them. Aluminium! There's a lot of aluminum stuff around here. Or remember how Borderlands 3 would ask you if you wanted to skip it to where the, their person was on the stair. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, no, this one... Not like that. Damn. This thing blew up to pieces. I'm not even, like, seeing any water where I'm at. I need to go... Find a stinky, nasty swimming pool. Stinky, nasty swimming pool. 
I'm gonna have to do it for Wawa because if he gets in the water, he's immediately gonna be all like, ah, getting radiation poisoning. Well, I also have the perks that I'm actually taking radiation away. Hmm. Ah. Yep, even if I'm not immune to the water. Or even if I'm immune to the water, I'm still not immune to the fucking barrels that are. <coughs> Do I not have my Aqua Boy perk equipped right now? Because I'm every time I get in the water, I'm getting rads. No, I got Aqua Boy. Larry said I died and I'm not even in the damn game. How did how did you die if you're not in the game? I don't understand. You must have laughed so hard it hurt. What am I getting radiation from right now? What the fuck, man? Alright, I'm just following the stream of water, hoping it's going to lead me into a bigger pool, and then I'll swim around in the pool. And look at the bottom for... Oh, you know what? I wonder if it's like Minecraft, where if you get it just the right angle, you can... Yeah, no, it's not. Hello? Nope, not a safe. Well, I found water. Let's see. Part of the toxic pond and wreckage is an unmarked location of the toxic valley region of Appalachia. It is located southeast of the Graninger Farm and southwest of Philippi Battlefield Cemetery. Okay. So we're looking in the wrong spot. Oh, I'm looking in the wrong spot. Yeah, you're north and I'm west of Garinger Farm and apparently we need to be <coughs> Toxic Pond and Wreckage. The yeah, the wreckage in this location's name refers to a sunken house which has collapsed into a pond of toxic water. Uh, okay. y yeah, interesting. Hmm. I found like a, hey, <laughs> we found each other. <laughs> I found a Wawa. <laughs> I was Somebody's purchasing stuff at my base. Oh, nice, nice, very nice. It's so funny to me still. That's okay. I finally figured out how to get the critical too. Yeah, so, okay, so, so when you're in VATS, apparently you have to press triangle first in order for the next hit to be the critical. And you can only do that after the crit meter fills up. <laughs> I still don't know where the crit meter is. Uh, yeah. That's ridiculous. Literally, I, I read that, and the next thing I shot, I, I did it. I was like, oh my god, thank you, I've been trying to do this mission for da -da 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 days. Ooh. 
prison marshals are after me again, Josh. I'm sorry, I'm because I'm still wearing my prison collar, but I like it. Found a sunken boat. Oh, that's cool. Partially sunken. I found a nice toxic pond where I'm at, but I don't see a house in it. Here, I'll send you. Let's see if I can send you the picture of the front of it. Open image. Alright, I just text you kind of like the picture of what it looks like, apparently, from the like, outside. This is the Warden of Eastern... This is the Warden of Eastern Regional Penitentiary. Our last okay. prisoner count came Nico up says hi sure. to us. Obviously there's been a mass breakout. Really? Nico? Nikolai? Out escaping prisoners. Due to overcrowding in the logistics of caring for live prisoners. Well, hello, Nikolai. Seems to be an issue. You're to make me laugh. No time to fix it now. I must stop those escapees. Oh, god damn it. Motherfucker. I'm all running towards wherever you're. Marker is placed all the way down on the bottom of the fucking map again, uh, following the wrong fucking marker. I'm like, where am I going? I hate that. There really should be, um, <sighs> Nico didn't stay very asleep very long apparently, but. Does that mean you're gonna come over, Wawa? I mean, Larry? Anyway. They really should make it, uh, so when you're placing a marker on the map, you can make it so whether it's, like, visible to everybody or just you. In my opinion. You're, like, nowhere n near where it says it's supposed to be. It says it's south... Um. Oops. No, I'm I'm figuring it out, man. I'm almost there. All right, you you sh if you, when you find it, let me know. Right. But it says the place we're looking for. Southeast of Graninger Farm, and uh, you, sir, are west of Graninger Farm. Uh, well, shit. <laughs> <gasps> Bleach dogwood right by my base? No way. Now that's what it looks like. I didn't know that. No wonder you were selling it for a dollar. Wow, that is a toxic ass looking pool. Yeah, Larry's like, yeah, at least be able to like change the color of your destination marker so like one's mine one's yours you know something other than just move remove or cancel oh your destination marker is still on the map trying to trick me up again Take it off. trying to trip me up again I started following it started looking for it I wonder if they there's a few times where I've been like looking something up online and it uh, I go there in the game wherever it says and like there's no sign of it 
So I and you know how they are. Like we we even heard that like if too much shit gets posted online, the developers change things around. Right. So I'm wondering like if this information is even old, accurate information anymore, because. I am following the descriptions of what I am reading and not see wait I found it no. <laughs> yeah I did I found it <laughs> uh, okay now I just need to find the safe I found it oh I found a rusted key uh, oh I found ah crap I just Oh, okay, thank God. I thought it was going to make me drink toxic water. Eh. Bam. I have an alien blaster. Freaking nice. It's about damn right, time. Wait, this, this is southeast of the farm. That's what I said. Oh, you said, I thought you, I thought you said southwest. No. And I have video recordings to re to prove it too. There's a safe on mine. Is completely open and the alien blaster is just sitting in there. Yeah. Oh, good. I thought. Yeah. So I took a, a a rusted key and the alien blaster out of it just like that too. I was kind of hoping that since I took it, you wouldn't be able to. But whatever. <laughs> alien blaster. Twenty damage. Uh, that's not very high. It literally just went up by one. What, what was that? Your damage went up by one? Yeah, my strength is going up with the radical. That's weird. Just went back down. What do you mean? The damage went from like 25 to 26? No, uh, it was 20, and it went to 21, and I thought it went back down to 20, now it's at 22. Mine says. Probably just the reds. Mine says 25. Yeah. Mine's also level 20. Well, fuck me. <laughs> uh, That's all. Oh, yeah, probably. Well, Josh, Michael, a uh, smoke break? Um... Or do we just get ammo and use this very quickly? Yeah, I I really you know it says it only does uh, one damage. Okay, right there I can see uh, per or twenty five damage per shot. But I've heard it's one of the most powerful weapons in the game, so I'm wondering why. Well, I've heard that yeah, be, even though it only does twenty five damage, what I heard the reason it's powerful is that it like melts your enemies quickly or something. Um, but yeah, I don't know. I wanna. You actually. Oh, you had some with you. There's some at my base. I have a lot. I'll, I'll give some to you. Oh, I got 450. I'm gonna go back to the base and get it right now. Oh, okay. Yeah, it sounded like a ray gun. Give you. Yeah, see, I just feel like the the base that you had, the uh, the like that first one that you quote unquote like you say stole from me. Yeah. Uh, I don't need like the there. Oh, there's the acid extractor. That's right. That's pretty nice. But the fertilizer, I can make at any base now. And then junk extractors, I don't need those because we can build the Nuka Cola Collectron and set him to collect junk. Oh, and if you can't make the um, Brahmin pen, um, I just recently picked up a plan for it, and I already have it. So if you don't have it, you can have it. That way you can put a cow in your base and get more fertilizer. I don't, I haven't been using, oh, here we go. I was like, I haven't been using this base very much. 
Alien Blaster Rounds. I have 182. Dude, 400. You have how many? I have 182. Okay, I got 450. I'll give you some. So 450 rounds literally weighs one pound. Stack weight. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. But it actually counts as three pounds when you actually do the math. Um, to make alien blaster rounds, holy shit, all you need is copper, lead, and plastic. You're like, I don't have any copper, though. <laughs> I'm at my base. I'm killing frogs. With the alien blaster? Yeah, that's six damage per round. So you couldn't even kill a frog with it one hit? No. What the I fuck? Don't have, I don't have any of the first cards, uh... For the pistols, I gotta get all those going. On. Still, I mean, so seven, six or seven damage, just as it is. Apparently, there's an alien blaster and. Fallout 4 as well. Yeah, yeah, of course. The alien mission was awesome. You get abducted by aliens, you're on their ship, they do tests on you, you're in the chamber, you find a way to sneak out, and you just kill all of their asses and get out. And as soon as you're out, you can never go back and get any of those guns or ammo ever again. So whatever you get out of there with, that's all you got. Who's fun, though? So, yeah, apparently this gun's actually not that great. Uh, interesting. Well, at least we have it now. I am actually going to hop off and head to the store to get that beer I was talking about. But I will join your game again and start broadcasting again when I get back in probably like fucking 10 minutes. Nice. So. Alright, peace.